the recording of music has has helped spread songs and words and messages out across the world into people's bedrooms and onto their headphones and so the power of recorded sound I think is um is um is amazing and and that's what really made me want to start recording what I was writing when I was younger um and the power of sound can you know it has the power to kill people like there's like Russian spy um guns that can kill people with like sub bass and there's like but it also has the power to make people fall in love you know so it's um it's a, a magic power you know sound is yeah I really wanted to work with an orchestra I wanted to work on very positive themes and um and uh, also work with quite exotic instruments like the duduk which is an Armenian instrument and uh, and get a bit more um, world with it and I uh, went to Paris and worked with a, um, a musician called Thomas Block who plays crystal bache and glass harmonica and really really rare instruments so um, um, to make something that was kind of quite um, what's the word um, quite digestible by a lot of people but to be subversive with it by using lots of interesting instruments that people hadn't heard before. Working with Patti Smith has been a big, uh, a really big moment for me and, and a relationship that has developed over the last few years and um, and then just really get, seeing getting album five in my hands and putting it, lining it up, you know, like Lego next to the other albums and seeing this kind of journey in CDs and through albums and uh, and just just thinking about actually you know today I'm playing on Clapham Common and and um, when I was 16 years old I worked at the the cafe on Clapham Common and used to make sandwiches for people and um, that was the only thing I was really qualified to do back then and um, and just thinking you know I'm playing on the main stage and um, and I remember yeah spreading in a, in a depression, people's like salmon sandwiches, and tuna sandwiches, and just thinking like, I've got so much more to give than this. So um, it's really nice to know 10 years on, um, I've kind of changed everything in my life and I've got five albums to my name. And it's, yeah, I, I get moments where I have to pinch myself quite a lot. So yeah, it's kind of the, the journey is the thing that, the, the journey I've been on is, the, is my proudest moment. You know, it's one long experience. I, never want to swap for any other experience in my life, so yeah.